Hello friends, this video on mensuration part 6 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So with this we have learned a lot about the area and perimeter of many different shapes. So let us try out a few questions. Question number 1. The diagonal of a quadrilateral shaped field is 24 meters and the perpendiculars dropped on it from the remaining opposite vertices are 8 meters and 13 meters. Find the area of the field. So in this case, it is a general quadrilateral. It, there, nothing has been spoken about whether it is a square or a rectangle or a trapezium. It is just a general quadrilateral. And what are the values which are given here? So if you look at this, if let's name this uh, quadrilateral A, B, C, D. So in this case, you see the length of the diagonal is given and the length of the perpendiculars dropped on the diagonals are also given. Now we already know that the area of a general quadrilateral is given as half into diagonal into sum of the perpendiculars dropped on the diagonal and all these three values are already given in this problem. So this would be half into diagonal which is 24 meters into h1 and h2 which is 8 and 13 respectively. So this would be half into 24 into 21. So this is 12. So 12 into 21 is 252 meters square. So this is the area. Question number two. The floor of a building consists of 3000 tiles which are rhombus shaped and each of its diagonals are 45 centimeters and 30 centimeters in length. Find the total cost of polishing the floor if the cost per meter square is rupees 4. So let's assume that this is the floor and the floor is made up of tiles which are in the shape of rhombus. So here if you look at, so I am not drawing the entire thing, I am just trying to give you an idea. So if you focus at each tile, it is in the shape of a rhombus. So each tile in the shape of a rhombus. So please note that. So how many tiles do we have? We have a total of 3000 tiles. Now if we want to find out the total cost of polishing this floor, for that what do we need to know? We need to find out the area of the floor. So how do we find out the area of the floor? So area of the floor would be equal to the area of the 3000 tiles and each tile is a rhombus. So basically if you are able to find out the area of the 3000 rhombus, this area of 3000 rhombuses is the area of the floor. That's simple. So for that, first of all, our first step would be to find out the area of one rhombus. Now we have find, found out for ourselves that area of a rhombus is given by half into product of the diagonals. Now in this problem, the length of the diagonals are given as 45 and 30. So this would be half into 45 into 30. So 2 into 15 is 30. So 45 into 15 is equal to 675 centimeters square. This is the area of one rhombus. So therefore, the area of 3000 rhombuses would be equal to 3000 into 675 which is equal to 2025000 centimeter square. So we can convert it into meter square. So we know that 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeter. Therefore, 1 meter square will be equal to 10,000 centimeter square. Therefore, 1 centimeter square would be equal to 1 divided by 10,000 meter square. Right? So therefore, this much centimeter square would be equal to 2025000 divided by 10,000 meter square. So this here 000 will cancel out. So it is 202.5 meter square. So this is the total area of the floor. So now let us try to find out the cost. So in the problem it is given that the cost per meter square is rupees 4. That means cost for 1 meter square. So if the area is 1 meter square then the cost is rupees 4. 
so therefore if the area is 202.5 meter square then the cost would be rupees 4 into 202.5 which is equal to rupees 810 so 810 would be the total cost of polishing the floor Thank you. Please visit examfear.com for free quality education. You can learn with a simple four step learning process wherein you can watch video lessons, you can ask your questions, you can refer notes and you can take a free online test. We have content for class 6 to 12 on physics, chemistry, mathematics and biology along with practical videos. So please subscribe to our channel for daily updates. Thank you.